My apologies. Our deliberations took longer than expected. Think nothing of it. The time afforded me the opportunity to go on a rather rousing excursion through Yansha. You have reached a decision then? We are willing to cooperate with you in combating the Icon threat, and also in the exchange of prisoners. Assuming you accept our conditions, of course. As you know, your sister is in our care. Due to certain complications, however, we are hesitant to release her into your custody. Complications? She was inside Doma Castle when it collapsed. Though she survived, she remembers nothing of her past life, not even her name. To clarify, she is in our care not as a prisoner, but as a vulnerable citizen of Doma. Are you saying you refuse to release her? Not at all. If her memory returns before the appointed hour. And if not, what exactly? You will accommodate her here in Dorma? Well, I sincerely doubt she will be of any great strategic value to the Empire. She spends her days daydreaming of Dango. Dango? How dreadful. Very well. In light of our recent misstep in Sakazuki, it seems only fair that I show you the same understanding you have shown us. Though I do have one small request. Regardless of Yotsuyu's value to the Empire, she is yet my sister. Before I leave, might you permit me to speak with her in private? Of course. Perhaps you could even bring her a plate of dango. She would be most pleased. Yugiri will see you to her chambers.
I wish you a safe journey. This has been a most enjoyable visit. I look forward to our next meeting. Maxima, would you take the others and see that all is ready for our departure? I simply cannot leave without first giving thanks to the Warrior of Light for accompanying me through Yansha. Mark me, saviour of the savages. There will be a reckoning. Traitor! Ignorant savages! Killing us will avail you naught! For every Imperial you cut down, a thousand more will come! Abandon this foolish endeavor and surrender! You may yet serve our righteous cause. How dare you speak of righteousness? You who forsook kith and kin to serve conquerors! Be glad I grant you this mercy. Reinforcements? No, just one! Cut him down! This one is promising. Who remains to offer us resistance? A, a, a host of rebels led by Lord Kyen hold the enclave across the river. Lord Kyen. King of the, the the former King of Dorma, sir. They say he is one of the greatest swordsmen alive. Is that what they say? Who was that? 
surely you jest. That was Zenos Ye Galvas, Legatus of the Twelfth, the Crown Bloody Prince. I heard he was strong, but that... that was frightening. That was... Lord Zenos. Everything you are, your power, even your face, it vexes me. Go on. Lash out like the beast you are at an emissary and jeopardize the newfound peace between Dorma and the Empire. My lord was destined to lead us unto a glorious new age. Your light is nothing to his radiance. I will cherish this moment, lock it away within my heart, until the day we meet again. You look troubled, my friend. Was it something he said? Of all the memories to witness... I had my doubts about him, but I would never have guessed he was a disciple of Zenos. My lord. Calm yourself, Yugiri. I set no store by him or his enlightened brethren. But if by treating with them there is even the faintest hope we might secure the return of our conscripted brothers and sisters, I must play this game. After the way I risked their lives in the rebellion, I owe them that much. My lord. You bear no blame for their fate. If not blame, then responsibility. They were prisoners, and still I chose to fight, knowing they could be executed in retaliation. But now we have a chance to bring them home. If it means bargaining with a monster, so be it. My lord. Besides, I think he likes me. Which is more than some can say.
Can you truly remember nothing? Nothing at all? Were we... friends? Yes! We were good friends, you and I. In fact, I've brought you a gift. I pray that one day soon, as you gaze into that mirror, you will remember the woman staring back at you. It's so pretty. Who are you? Who are you? How are you feeling, my lord? Fine, now leave me. so frail that I cannot feed myself. Ah, I grow weary of the taste of gruel. You don't like it? Can I fetch you something else? Aye, wine! Or if that is not wholesome enough, I don't know. A sweet persimmon from Namai? I enjoyed them in my youth. Nay, pay me no mind. I am full. Besides, we have guests. I hope we are not interrupting your meal. We had heard you were confined to bed and thought you might welcome some visitors. Confined to... A gross exaggeration. A trifle drained from my exertions, perhaps. But with a little rest, I shall be fighting fit again in no time. Take off your clothes. Gosetsu, is this how you've been spending your time? My lady, I assure you, this is not... Off with them! We need to wash you, you stink! These scars. There are so many of them. A life of battle will leave its mark upon a man.
Is something wrong to you? It's nothing. I'm fine. But leave me be, woman! I will not be fussed over like some newborn babe.
greetings. Might I have one of your... Wait! Please! I only wanted a persimmon! Kami, save us! Her spirit has returned! She's back from the dead to seek her revenge! It can't be. She couldn't have survived. What did I... What did I do? As if you don't know! Good people of Namai, be at ease, I pray. You have naught to fear. My lord, forgive me, but what is that monster doing here? They told us she was dead! I too was surprised to learn of her survival. More even than you, I would hazard. T'was I who cut her down, I who left her to her fate. But it would seem the Kami had other plans. By some miracle, both she and Gosetsu were spared when the keep collapsed, though Yotsuga's preservation came at the cost of her memory. You're saying she's forgotten? Forgotten everything she's done? Lies! Lies! My lord, she would say anything to escape punishment! What does it matter? We have not forgotten her crimes, and we demand justice! I beg of you, Lord Hien, draw your blade and rid us of this canker! What I saw then, it's all true. I'm sorry! I'm so, so sorry! You're sorry? I'm not. We're supposed to forgive you! Here, there's no need to cry. Can't you see how scared she is? How can you be scared of her? She's not the same. Until such time as her memories return, this woman shall be known as Tsuyu and treated as a citizen of Doma. I will, however, see that she is watched at all times. Rest assured that there will be no more unannounced visits to the village. As your lord, I ask that you leave her fate in my hands and suffer her to live for now. Please, Issei. All right. I'll keep my peace. As long as you're happy, that's all that matters.